Welcome to the Thargoid Report. I'm Commander Burr. This is a distillation of the excellent weekly thread from Burton Simmons on Reddit. For finer details on the why and the what of the Thargoids activity then do give that post a look. I've linked it below. If you find this information useful and enjoy our content then please consider giving the video a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button to make sure you see all our future videos. The following stations were attacked by Thargoids this week and are currently on fire and subject to ongoing rescue operations. Charnas Station in HIP 14997 Lee Orbital in Eloneti Pelt Orbital in Gorongathi Ryazansky Enterprise in Otherney Shaw Port in Kotageni Vry's Terminal in Goronxians As well as evacuating civilians from these stations you can also help delivering food, water, basic medicines and natural fabrics to the affected stations. If you are going into a burning station bring all the heat sinks. Links to my previous videos on this subject are below. In an attempt to make me even more uncomfortable reading the names out than I already am the following difficult to pronounce systems are being reported as showing signs of Thargoid infestation by the Eagle Eye sensor network. Heng Sokalsi Quiamoni Adnoa Noda Savaratia and Valtam if you are engaging in anti-Thargoid scout combat operations you don't necessarily need specialised equipment but the entry level anti-xeno weaponry requires no unlocking and it really helps. The scout class vessels also count as elite ranked ships so this is an excellent way to level up your combat rank. For the more hardcore combat zone encounters the following systems are under Thargoid incursion right now and will have combat zones that offer both scouts and larger Thargoid vessels. Garonxians HIP 14997 Elorneti Gorongathi, Cottigeni and Otherney. For the scouts and the death daisies I'd recommend decontamination limpets are added to your standard arsenal and you might want to think about taking shed loads of heat sinks as well. The cone sector critters will struggle to track you when you're cold. With the assistance of the AXI Discord all the systems I've listed this week are now presented in priority order. If you're looking to wing up with other commanders then I've provided links below to the AXI, the Hive, the Hand and the Squadrons of Humanity. Between them these organisations have all platforms covered and will help you find advice as well as comradeship. Wherever you go commanders remember pick your fights with care. You can also get involved with Operation Ida and help get previously damaged stations back online. Ida coordinate the rebuilding efforts for the wider galactic community and will have you covered on where to go and what to bring with you. All you need is a galactic map and a few cargo racks. That's it for now. Thank you so much for making it this far. You can also find us on Twitter, Patreon, Discord and Instagram. Links to all those are in the description below and I'll be back later this week with more videos. Until then ….o7 CMDRs may all your hyper addictions be brief and don't let the danger daffodils give you nightmares. I very much look forward to seeing you next time. <laughs>